Hi everyone, welcome back to a new yoga video. Today I'm going to be guiding you through a short and simple sequence you can practice in your bed. So we'll go ahead and get started in a comfortable seated position. I have already placed a pillow underneath my sit bones because it feels nice to have the hips elevated a bit. So feel free to do the same. And we'll start to bring some awareness into the body. Maybe you've just recently woken up and you feel a little tight or uh, tender in certain areas or muscles. Maybe uh, checking in with a quick body scan. Starting with the toes. Moving up to the ankles. The calves the hips and hamstrings and continuing to take note of your upper body bringing awareness without any judgment And then becoming aware of the breath. Placing one hand on the chest and the other on the low belly. Filling the lungs completely with every inhale. Feeling your chest, belly, maybe even ribs expand. And with every exhale, finding more space, more softness, maybe relaxing the shoulders down away from the ears, feeling your sit bones connected to the pillow or the bed. And taking a few more deep breaths here. On your next inhale, slowly reach the arms up towards the sky. And as you exhale, place the right hand down, reach the left arm up and over. Placing the left hand down, finding a side forward fold, so relaxing the head and neck. Keeping both sit bones firmly planted. And on your next inhale, come back up, finding a twist, bringing the left hand towards the back and the right hand on the left knee. Inhale, come back to center. And exhale, place the left hand down, right hand reaches up and over. Dropping the right arm down, finding a side forward fold. Drawing the shoulder blades away from each other. Inhale to come up. And as you exhale, twist, bringing the right hand along the back, the left hand on the right knee. And slowly untwisting, we'll find a few gentle neck stretches. So drawing the right ear towards the right shoulder, using your right hand to gently assist. Releasing the right hand down, drawing the left ear towards the left shoulder, using the left hand to help. Placing the left hand down, and releasing the fingers behind the base of the skull, draw the elbows together, bringing the chin to the chest. Maybe you gently rock the neck side to side. And 
releasing the hands back down and just rolling the neck a few more times. From here, extend the left leg straight out in front, keeping the right leg crossed. Inhale, find to length, and as you exhale, fold forward over the left leg, bringing the forehead to the knee, relax the head and neck. Inhale, slowly reach the arms up. And as you exhale, twist, bringing the right hand towards the back, left hand to the right knee. And switching legs, extending the right leg straight out in front. As you inhale, reach the arms up. And as you exhale, forward fold. And on your next inhale, slowly come up. And exhale, twist, right hand to left knee, left hand towards the back. Coming back to center, drawing the soles of the feet together, interlacing the hands, wrapping them around the feet, finding a nice tall spine here, Baddha Konasana. Staying here if that feels good, and if you'd like, you can find a forward fold. Coming up, if you're in your forward fold, we'll straighten out the legs in front of the body. Inhale, reach the arms up. And exhale, forward fold. Relax the head and neck here. Feel the shoulder blades draw apart. Inhale, slowly, vertebrae by vertebrae, make your way up to a seated position. Bringing the hands to the knees, we'll find some seated cats and cows. So as you inhale, lift the heart, open the chest. Exhale, straighten out the arms, round through the spine. Inhale, lift the chin. And exhale, draw the shoulder blades apart. Move through this at your own pace. Finding any other organic movement that feels good, maybe shifting the hips from side to side, finding circular movements. Coming back to a normal position, if you have a pillow underneath your sit bones, go ahead and place it to the side. We'll go ahead and lay on the back. Bring the knees into the chest. Give yourself one big hug. Rock your body from side to side. And moving into happy baby, bringing the arms inside of the knees, hands along the outer blades of the feet, drawing the knees towards the outer ribs, soles of the feet facing the ceiling. And extending the left leg, drawing the right knee into the chest. We'll go ahead and straighten out the right leg, grabbing a hold of the back of the calf or the thigh, whatever feels comfortable for you. You could even place the left sole of the foot on the ground. And we'll go ahead and lift the head and neck up, drawing the forehead towards the knee. We'll find supine pigeon crossing the right ankle on top of the left leg, straightening out the left leg as best as you can, lifting it up towards your body. Maybe you gently rock side to side. And you can have a micro bend of the knee here if that feels better. Place the left leg back down. Go ahead and draw the left knee into the chest, extending the right leg. And straightening out the left leg, grabbing a hold of the calf. And lifting the head and neck up, bringing the forehead to the knee. Maybe bringing the right sole of the foot on the ground. 
finding supine pigeon, straightening out to the right leg, lifting it up, drawing both knees closer towards the body. Go ahead and uncross, bringing both soles of the feet back onto the bed. We'll find eagle legs here, crossing the right leg over the left, twisting towards the left side. If it's comfortable for you, you can bring your gaze over the right side. Coming back through center, uncross, bringing the left leg over the right, twisting towards the right side, and again, gaze is towards the opposite side. Coming back to center, uncrossing the legs, bringing the knees to the forehead, rocking yourself up a few times, and then coming up into a comfortable seated position. And just find gratitude for yourself for finding time to stretch and move. Being thankful for this body and all that it does for us. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Namaste.